first two years of college, I started at Florida Atlantic. Then I transferred. I went to Monmouth in New Jersey. And then I was a graduate transfer, so I was able to come here. I got in connection with Coach Cleveland. He found me, he saw a video, and uh, we took it from there. Uh, his energy is contagious. I mean, defensively, he's one of our better defensive players, especially on the ball. Defense intensity, bringing energy, and I think those are all the characteristics that I bring to the game. It makes me want to be a, a de better defender, actually. It's kind of like sometimes when he goes, we go. And it's distributing the basketball, getting in the lanes and finishing, uh, just making tough plays. If I need to screen, if I need to play defense, get guys the ball, bring energy, score when I can, just be an overall player and just lead by example. Obviously, this is the first time we've had you know, it's a new coach, it's a whole new team, new pieces, so that takes time, but I think we've gotten it pretty quickly. I think we have a good, well-balanced team. When we all play collectively, we're one through 13, everybody can pitch in and help this team, which is the best advantage we have. Nick is an older, you know, he's married, uh, got a kid, he's, and you can just sense that, you know, his sense of urgency is, is probably a little greater than some of the other guys. So I have a about to be nine month old, daughter and it's tough man so i have to facetime them every day they came for a few games so i got to see them sporadically but nothing crazy so i get to i miss out on that missing family events not seeing your family i mean the team becomes your family you see them more than you see your own parents than your own siblings everything so it's kind of crazy how much time you miss from home like when you get back home it's a whole different thing so much stuff has happened so it, it's kind of bittersweet the advice i got from my family because I, I wasn't gonna come play basketball. I was gonna raise my family and, and get a job, but they told me that this is what you love to do, so we're willing to sacrifice for this year so you can come play and do what you love. So I had great people around me, my wife, I credit her, my parents, and everybody encouraged me to do this. So I had to sit back and think about it. It was a tough decision and sometimes I kind of question it, but I think it's, it's working out. I would say my why is, is my family and just being the best person I can. So just trying to be who God made me be, find my calling in life and just push and get better each and every day.